Hey guys, this is Scott Leroy, Scott Leroy Marketing, coming in for another weekly tip. And today's tip is on a newer item that recently launched from KW, where you can actually feature your listings. So this has been a, a very sought after item to display over on your kw.com site, your command site in this case, and now it is available for you. So all you need to do is sign into obviously your command account like I am right now. I'm gonna X out of this, just wanna clear that up. And then we're gonna click on the consumer option over here on the left hand side. Now, once again, if this is not displaying for you, please zoom out on your web browser and it should pop up immediately. All right, so depending on your screen size, it may not pop up right away, but if you zoom out, you'll be perfect. All right, now once we click on that, then this is gonna take us to the back end of our consumer section. And what we wanna do is click on site and app settings up here at the top right. All right, so we'll click on site and app settings, and this is gonna take us to the back end of our site and our app settings, obviously, where we can update our command site, we can update some of our app info, and if you notice, there's a new section on here for featured listings. All right, so I'm gonna click on featured listings real quick. All right, and once you do that, if this pops up saying, sorry, something happened while we load this page for you, reload, all right, you try and click and reload on here, it's not working, all right, make sure that you've gone through the Learn More with Kelly Guides to activate featured listings on here. All right, so I'm gonna click on Learn More with Kelly Guides real quick, and we'll just have to do this once, which is the good part. I mean, once you do it once, you're all good to go. All right, but I'm gonna click on Consumer Settings once I click on Learn More with Kelly Guides. And right, I'll click on that Continue option on here. All right, and now it's gonna take us through that Kelly Guide to actually update a few items on here. All right, so if I click on Get Started, I'm gonna scroll down a little bit further. I'll click the Next button on here now to go to the next page. And if you can see, now we have the app download and now there's one called Featured Listings. So what we'll actually do on here is click the arrow next to Featured Listings. All right, and here's the button we wanna select, Show Featured Listings. All right, so once we check this and it's green, much like we see on all the other items on command, once it's green, it's gonna be activated. We can then put inside our title on here. See, we'll need to put inside a title. Featured listings is perfect. <laughs> All right, and then you can even select your listings from here too. Now, if you notice, this is where the featured listings will actually display at the bottom, and here's just kind of a, a you know an example, basically, of what it'll look like. Now, when we click on featured listings on here, it's gonna pop up where we can actually search for property addresses. We can go through and search by MLS numbers. All right, completely up to you. And if you notice, we can actually select up to 12 on here. All right, so you can actually go through and select any ones that you want to. But if I click on Save and Continue on here, it'll save that immediately. Now then you can actually go through and complete the Kelly Guide. In this case, I'm gonna click the X button up here because I already completed what I need to. All right, but if you wanna complete the rest, feel free. Here we go. So now that I've gone through and I've activated Featured Listings, when I click on Site and App Settings at the top right, and I go to Featured Listings on here, all right, now we have the option for it. So now we're gonna see our featured listings header text. We can actually see the selected listings. And if I click on select listings on here, first thing first, it's gonna pop up with our properties. So as you can see, we're showing only my listings. So if I wanna feature all these, I can click the select button. And any that are linked up inside the KWLS 2.0 that are listed as ourself as the agent, we can find immediately. Or of course, you can always click on the top right and go to all listings to search for that right away too. All right, but once I click done on here, these are all set up. I can actually go through and reorganize these. I can delete them. Completely up to you as to how you want this to look. But the cool part is once this is updated, so the featured listings are saved. All right, I'm gonna come back over here. I'm gonna look at the site real quick. All right, so this is taking us over to our command website where we can actually see the new featured listings that we just set up on here. So now if I scroll down, all right, my featured listings will start to pop up on here. All right, so as we can see, here's one of the new ones that's automatically displaying. All right, so it's that simple to go through and actually set up your featured listings to display immediately. All right, and that's all you have to do in order to update this right away. So there you go. So that is your KDB command tip for the day.